just th I'm 31. I just this year found out that I was a fat guy. I'm from a white trash enough town that this was killing it. People back home see me, they're like, what's your fucking secret? I'm like, oh, I'm just hanging out, man. It's mostly hanging out. <laughs> and then, I don't know, I moved, uh, I moved to Philly first. I lived in Philly for like two years. Yeah, gay birds. And then, uh, but it was funny because I moved like from a white trash town to Philly, like right during the presidential election. <laughs> You pussies. Uh, no, but it was funny because like that was a big jump. I went from like an all white trash town to then to the city where now all my new friends were like real woke, and that was like because if like if this was my hometown, someone could just walk in here in full camouflage and sit down, and you'd be like, that's a fucking good outfit. <laughs> are you, are you trying to get pussy in here tonight, dude? Come on, man. You're going full camo at Clusterfest. All right. Like everybody I grew up with listens to country music. And I don't, but I get it. Like, I understand why white people like it. You know, like you can relate to it. You can understand all the lyrics. You don't need to Google what a nene is. It's not, I don't know if you know this, every country song's just about exactly what a white guy's doing at that moment. It's like, I turn the radio up. It's like, yeah, fuck yeah. That's good, that's music, that's what I like. I get it, you can relate to it. I ride around, I listen to rap. That's all I listen to. I can't relate to one fucking song. I just ride around by myself, bob my head, just like, I beat the pussy up. Just like, oh, huh. I, like I don't know if I beat it up. Like, I'm like, I'll shadow box the pussy. I've never, I've never knocked it out. Everyone's knocking out pussies. I've never knocked it out. Not, I'm more like Floyd Mayweather with a pussy, very technical. Very defensive. <laughs> That's all I listen to. I just ride around, listen to people brag about how good they are at sex. I don't think I've ever made a girl make a sound with my dick. <laughs> Except like when I lay on them at first and they're like, <laughs> That's it, just, oh Jesus, mister. <laughs> Yeah, good. So that's where I'm from. And then I moved to the city. And here, let me lose you again real quick. Uh, it was right during the presidential election. And uh, it was funny because all my friends went from like white trash to like I said, woke. And they were all like, they were all like, did you guys all vote Democrat? Did anybody here vote? <laughs> do, you guys, do you guys remember how like confident you guys were? Going into that last one? Huh, you remember that? A little borderline arrogant going into that. All right, don't let it cost you again. No, I relax, relax. I did not vote for him. Yeah, fuck yeah. <laughs> no, I, act I actually did not vote for him, which that was tough. Look at me. His whole campaign was at me. I was watching TV, he was like, are you a fucking fat idiot? I was like, yeah, dude. <laughs> yeah, what are we doing? <laughs> what the fuck are we doing, dude? We're building walls? Hell yeah. <laughs> I took skull out of my mouth to come up here. <laughs> and I didn't vote for Donald Trump. Makes me like the Nelson Mandela of central Pennsylvania. <laughs> You guys are all right. I want you guys to know, though, I do have black friends. <laughs> no, it's nice having black friends when the rest of your friends are just fucking goofy white guys. It's nice, you get some outside perspective, some advice. You just gotta be careful of the advice you take from your black friends when it comes to, like, sex. When you look like Uncle Buck, it doesn't <laughs> translate. Like, this is the advice my friend gave me when I went on a date with this chick. He was like, hey, yo, Shane, you don't want to go too deep in the pussy. She's always going to want the dick. He's like, you're, you're worried about depth? Like, depth is a I didn't even know they had depth. I'm just happy to be there. You're worried about, like, depth is an issue? He was like, you don't want to give her the whole dick. I'm like, that's all I have. 
What are you talking about? I've never been like halfway in and been like, oh, oh. You gotta earn the rest of this. Dick. That's insane. Depth? That's crazy. I'm worried about like the noises I'm making. Like I just, I just sound like, like a shitty ghost the whole time. Just like, oh, oh. It's almost done. Boy. Depth. For my face? You ever worry about your face when you're fucking? Don't do it. Don't, don't think about how dumb you look. You'll end up looking like a fucking psycho trying to look handsome the whole just. It's not good. It's worse for me if I let it go. Like if I just let my face go during sex. Like I, I look like Brandon Dassey from Making a Murderer the whole just. girl's down there and she's like, did you do it? I'm like, I don't know.